Hi, it's Tara Maxwell here. Saturday, I, I almost didn't go for a run. And I want to share with you my thought process around this because I know it'll make a difference for you. Um, listen to the end because if you make this simple tweak, it'll make a quantum shift in your money flow and your abundance. So I woke up in the morning. Um, I usually run at 5.30. And um, I thought, you know, my husband was out of town. He had a last minute flight to the U.S. And I thought, oh, it's fine, I'll just go for, go for a run. And then I realized, wait, this is a two hour run and I've got three kids at home and I cannot just take off. And so that window of opportunity left, I didn't run. And it would have been easy, an earlier version of myself, I just wouldn't have run. I had, I had my excuses, maybe my knee was hurting, maybe it would be a good reason to just um, skip it. And I want you to know, I'm, I'm training for a half marathon. And, you know, common sense would say, you know, it's just one run. What's the big deal? You can always make it up next week. You'll be fine. But when it comes down to it, I knew that this was a life and death decision. That might seem dramatic. But it, but it is because success, and not even just success, absolutely living our purpose, living in integrity, depends upon us being able to absolutely trust ourselves. So I want to share what I decided is uh, I just, I had made that commitment to myself to keep my word. And so instead of just letting it go, I problem solved. I, I made a phone call. I found a sitter to come at 4 o'clock. And you know what? It wasn't fun. At 4, I didn't have the same you know, drive to go running. I didn't have a proper lunch. I was not in a running mood. Normally I love it. But it didn't matter because I keep my word. And so as I was going for this run, I had, there are these mantras that I said. And I'm sharing with this with you because if you resonate with this, you will absolutely shift. I was running and I said, I keep my word. I keep my word. I keep my word. I keep my commitments to myself. I trust myself because with those three mantras or ideas, if this is true for you, that's like, that's like the foundation of confidence. And if you can absolutely say that with integrity, I keep my word, I keep my commitments to myself and to others, I trust myself, you can do anything. That means you could set a goal this year, whether it's making 10K a month or 20k month, whatever that is for you, and know with absolute certainty that you will reach it because you keep your commitments and you trust yourself. And, and I'm sharing this because if you look at the results that are showing up in your life, whatever is going on right now, I would venture to say that somewhere there's a gap in your commitment. Somewhere there's a place where you're hiding or where you don't really feel like you trust yourself. And so by making this simple decision, I keep my word, and look in your life, where can you make a different decision today? Um, it's interesting, but something like running can make such a difference um, in mindset, in other areas, in business, and how we show up as parents, um, in, in love. So those are my words for you today. I hope that makes a difference. Where can you more fully keep your word. Honor your truth. I said that with love here in Costa Rica. You can hear my, my dog is barking in the distance. Have a wonderful day. Bye.